Hey what's up everyone, so in this video I want to give kind of like a PSA kind of like how to enable this but uh, 60 frames per second is now playable on Fortnite mobile if you have an iPhone XS, XS Max or XR uh, and of course an, any newer generation iPhone follow those um, but so only those three devices are supported as of right now uh, make sure you're on the latest update that just came out today uh, November 27th and when you're in the lobby, go ahead and go into the little three menus in the upper right corner. Go to the settings. And then under the video settings, there's the mobile frame rate. Uh, if you have one of the three compatible devices, you can boost it up to 60 frames per second. Um, there's also 20 and 30, which was always uh, uh, an option before. So let's go and test out 60 frames per second and let's start up a game. So as you can see, just even the pre-game lobby, you can see it's a lot smoother. Um, definitely much improved over 30 frames per second. And it's definitely noticeable. Uh, I'll go ahead and show a clip of 30 frames per second side by side with this one. So you can kind of get an idea of uh, the difference between 30 and 60 frames per second when playing this game. So it looks pretty good. Uh, of course, there are some downsides here. So my phone does get pretty warm uh, pretty quickly after playing even just like a minute, minute and a half of this. Uh, just, you know, it's warm to the touch on the back, but it's not hot or anything. And of course, it's going to drain your battery a little bit quicker than usual, uh, just because, it, you know, it's doubling the amount of frames that it's producing. So definitely going to eat through your battery a little bit, so keep a charger close by. So of course, I'm using a screen recorder to record this. I just want to get the best quality picture to show you, you know, exactly the differences and everything and how it looks uh, on an iPhone XS Max. Um, but, you know, it does look just as good you know, in real life through a camera. Um, well, not, you know, just as good through a camera, but, you know, just as good in person. It, it looks really good. Definitely better than 30 frames per second. But that's pretty much it. Uh, make sure you go ahead and check that setting if you have an iPhone XS, XS Max, or XR, or newer. Um, no iPads are supported as of right now, which is kind of surprising, but, you know, maybe they'll get there eventually. Um, but yeah, so this is 60 frames per second on Fortnite Mobile looks pretty good. Uh, go ahead and check it out. Thanks for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.